Hello YouTube! This is Chris Collins with a short tutorial on how to add accidentals to trills and other ornaments in MuseScore 2.0. The reason that you would want to do this um, is if you wanted to create a trill that used notes outside of the scale. In my example here, I have a trill over the note D. I want this note to trill between D and E flat, but by default this symbol means that the note will trill between D and E. If I want it to trill between D and E flat, I need to add a flat sign above this ornament. So, I will show you how to do that. The first step is to add a text box to this note. We'll go over to the text palette here on the left, expand that, select staff text, and drag that to the note D. Let go of the mouse button, that is and uh, you can see this, the text appearing above the note. The next thing we need to do is open the master palette. This can be found in the view menu under master palette. Now there are a lot of uh, different categories here including an accidentals category but we can't really use this category because the accidentals here will change the note uh, instead of uh, changing our trill. So if I drag this flat here to this D, for example, then it becomes a D flat. That is not what we want. So instead, we're going to go down to the symbols category. And you can see there is a lot in this palette. We're going to have to scroll through here to find the accidentals that we want. So let's uh, scroll past these uh, Hebrew letters, uh, oh, that can't be right. Uh, scroll past the, the Death Stars, no, that can't be right either. The Lightning Bolts, I don't know what most of this stuff is to be honest, but uh, if you go far enough, you'll eventually find things like, here's a sharp. Here we have um, a bunch of different, you know, like the sharps have numbers by them and other things, so those are not the ones that you want to use. Um, now I have to go down here, here's the flat, and then a little further down we have the natural. So anyway, we've identified our flat here, and what we need to do now is uh, double click on this staff text. So now we're in text edit mode. I'm going to press Control A on my keyboard to select all the text. And then I'm going to drag the flat and drop it over this text, replacing it with the flat. There we go. Now you can see the flat's still a little bit on the small side. So let's select it again. I'm just going to use Control A, but you can also click and um, highlight it that way. And then we're going to increase the size to 14 point. And center it. And voila, we now have the proper notation for a trill with the upper note being flat. Now, just be aware that this will not play back um, with the flat uh, in MuseScore. It will still sound as an E natural, but at least any humans attempting to play this will do it correctly. So there you have it. That is how to add accidentals onto your ornaments in MuseScore. Have a wonderful day.